Hello, my lovely humans, welcome back to another Fabulous channel. I'm Jacob Japes here, and today we are having a speed build of an apartment in the apartment complex. I'll link that video in the cards. I'm also going to link a short for the people who I felt like would own this place. Sometimes, like, I'll, I'll have to talk about it, like, in the speed build of what I think they're kind of like and why I think they, they built these, like, this apartment the way they did. Hello, welcome back to another Fabulous speed build. Today we are doing the second, I'm going to say, downstairs apartment. I don't know if this is the first one or the second one. That's okay. This was my fourth or fifth apartment by this point, as once I got here. This one has a separate bedroom for, like, um, the infant. And essentially, one of the hardest things doing here is hallways in these apartments. I am not going to lie. Make sure you have enough space for all the bedrooms and all the different rooms and stuff. And because I'm not entirely sure if you need the heater and the electrical, that was also a huge struggle of mine when doing these. I don't need these. They shake my head weird when I'm doing it, just like when we're just talking to you. How are you doing today? Tell me how you're in the comments down below. If you made it to the speed build portion, go ahead and put a, um, we'll do a sun today in the comments down below. Uh, that way I know we, and I know that you're here. I know you're enjoying your time. Um, go ahead and give a big thumbs up as well. And if you're enjoying it, we are having speed builds the entire the month of January. If you're watching this when it came out. And if you love a good speed build, then I recommend sticking around and hitting that subscribe button. It really shows that you're enjoying the channel. That being said, let's go ahead and talk about this kitchen. I think this is the biggest kitchen in the entire apartment complex. If your Sims love to cook, this is the kitchen for you. I just didn't, they just ended up having this huge space over here when I did the designs and stuff. And it just worked out perfectly to have this like huge gigantic kitchen. All the appliances and stuff are the same throughout the entire thing. I've talked about that several times throughout the speed builds. Also, as you guys know, I did make a family for this one as well. This family is particularly fun. So it's the dad grew up in Mount Crombie and is an adventurer. He loves doing the mountains. He loves doing all this other stuff. Whereas the mom is a newbie actress. She uh, got to she got casted in a very big role coming up, and so they had to move out here to uh, Delso Valley for a temporary period of time. And yet the dad was like furious about having to move out here for a temporary period of time because like he can't none of the adventurer stuff that he really loves and things are out here. And so they end up having to move out here. They have an infant. And so she's having to do this big work schedule while also doing infant things. So like it is a very, it's very tremendous time. Oh my God. I love this mirror. This is such a good mirror in the game. I adore it so, so much. I think it's one of the best mirrors in the entire game. I also love the apartments and stuff because you can definitely tell that the mom came in and she's like, I'm the one decorating this apartment that we're moving here for me. And she went through and she just did, she went to nine. Like, you know, she got a big bonus and a big race, this big role and this new like big blockbuster. And like she's a new and upper comer like she did she went to like one interview and then boom she got the job and like it's a good time you ever seen famous in love like famous in love type of vibes not the you know people getting shot and i don't want to spoil anything in that tv show it's a bad tv show like i don't even think you can watch it anywhere it was about a foreign tv show that came out several years ago <laughs> what am i going on about it's from the creators that did pretty little liars and stuff but it went on for like two seasons and the first season was very guilty pleasure and the second season went full camp but He's had some point very early famous in love where it's like this big book series like Twilight and then you know you go out for a role and you're like oh gosh are they gonna pick me I'm a nobody and then they pick you because you have like great chemistry that's essentially what's going on here so you can also play into the storyline that she has such great chemistry with her co-star whoever her co-star is in this project that uh she's cheating or they could like film into a bigger relationship or whatever or maybe they already cheated and the, the son or the daughter I can't remember what they have in this particular family it's not even the dads. It is. I promise you. I had to make them. But maybe it's not. You never know. <laughs> I forgot to put lights up there. I really liked how this, this little kid's room turned out. I think it's so cute. I think it hit all the right spots in my opinion. I also... This is one of my favorite apartments if we're talking like true faves. I think this is so good. I just love it. I think it's so so nice. So modern. Um, it, it's definitely one of the most expensive apartments. They have like a marble top you're about to see. We're about to pull it out as we speak this like marble top from i want to say it was spa day that they have and it's just for your tv like that's how you know you're rich like who wants who needs marble they do because they rich <laughs> i love this couch with this blanket that one came from book nook kit 
and things like that. I think for the rest of next week, I think I might do try to do builds that are very much more like this and that. I want to build a hotel. I think maybe the hotel will come out after. I don't know when. I'm trying to figure out like when I want to build certain things. I'm going to have to sit down and, and make make plans and talk to my sister and see if she needs anything built. Because that's also something I do. I, I always ask them. I'll be like, hey, do you need anything built? Please please let me know. As sometimes I need, I need building material, you know, building ideas and stuff. Because now that the space is so much more open, I'm thinking of doing some retail shops and stuff. I don't know. I'm thinking... You know, I have to look at my worlds and be like, oh, I want an apartment complex in this world. Oh, a hotel will work in this world. I also want to play with a hotel and see how it will work. And so before I build one, I can be like, okay, this is what you got to do in game to make it functional. And maybe I'll make a video on that as well. Uh, so I might do a hotel a different month, like maybe like three or four months from now, only because of that. But by that point, someone maybe already made it. This is me kind of trying to figure out scheduling because this is where we're at in the recording process. This is like the fourth few people I've done. So and they're all like 10 minutes long. So, you know, you got to figure out what to talk about. With that being said, we're going to be actually jumping into a tour. We're doing is the last minute wallpapering, which I think the wallpaper turned out so cute, but you'll see it better in the tour. So let's go ahead and jump over to that, Jacob. All right. That being said, let's go ahead and do our little tour. Now, this is the first apartment that you walk in, you see on the bottom floor. All right. So you come on in. This one was really fun. I really liked the kitchen space so you have this space in here which is like your typical i would suggest maybe putting a mirror i wonder if i did have a mirror and it got deleted i don't know then once you come past like your normal area you have the kitchen space the walls are quite high because the door i wanted to use so just ignore those you can obviously put things on top as well but this is the kitchen i think it's a nice little nook obviously things are missing such as my fridge so i have to wonder if there was a wall there don't know why i have things missing that is a bit weird. This is your like middle space here as well with the bookcases and things. Here is the master bedroom, which I think turned out really, really pretty. Very fancy. If you guys want to know why, like it's again, go check out that short. I'm pretty sure I talked about it in this people as well. That's very much the reason why. Over here is a newborn room. So it's made specifically for newborns. Obviously this bed convert into a taller bed. I love putting this. I can't take any credit as you guys can see in the speed builds. I am just, I just don't do well these rooms. But I think it turned out cute. Even if I did build it like a hodgepodge. Oh, the bathrooms, that wall. This is the, this is probably like one of my favorite sip spaces. I don't know. I just really like how clean and, and cleansed it is. It is the living space. There's a computer here. The TV area I think looks really nice. There is not enough toys for the infant. I didn't realize, I just realized that. This is the bathroom. The bathrooms pretty much stay the same throughout the rest of the building. So the likely chance of me showcasing those in a tour is probably unlikely. And this is like the view that they get. Not the best view if you're on the lower floor apartments. I think you do want a higher floor apartment if you're looking for that view. Overall, I think it's a very cute apartment. I'm crappy. I don't know. I liked it. I don't know how to do these outros. I'm sorry. But that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What are you guys' thoughts and opinions on this apartment? Are you guys enjoying this like type of series type of thing and building the jackal apartments let me know in the comments down below and i'll talk to you guys all very very soon with another video soon thank you for watching and goodbye